purpose of this video is to show you how you can clean chrome. Um, the question comes up a lot. Will it remove chrome? Will it strip chrome off the surface? And the answer is no uh, with the correct abrasive. If you put um, a different abrasive other than glass bead slurry in the machine, you could remove this chrome coating. Um, as you can see, this, cr this chrome coating is, um, this is, uh, this is in really bad shape, so it would eventually have to be re-chromed, re-plated. So, um, but again, I just want to show you how um, you could clean this part up, and it's not going to touch the chrome. It's actually going to clean the pits in the piece and the part. Um, and again, this is a top cap cover for a, a carburetor body, and um, we're just going to clean the chrome up and, and show you what it does. But again, you know, this would need to be re-chromed re and re-plated. So let's put it in the machine and see what we have. back again we have completed the blasting of the carburetor body on the top cap here just to show you how it will clean chrome not remove chrome again this is with a glass bead slurry um, this is a non-aggressive process you can see the pitting and the damage that's done on this piece uh, but we just wanted to show you how it would clean uh, this particular part you can even see the bolt or the, the the tiny little bolts and screws here. How they were cleaned in the process. They were corroded before. Um, we didn't clean the rest of the car body. We just wanted to show you how it would not remove chrome. And uh, you can just see how it it cleaned in those pits. Uh, but this part would need to be stripped. It would need to be rechromed. Uh, but again, just to show you uh, how it it would not tear this chrome off the surface. I just want to zoom in again for you real quick. And you can see the pitting, but the, the cleaning that's been done. So if you want to learn more, we have a lot of videos up on YouTube. We have information written on the website. Uh, please shoot us an email. Give us a call if you have more questions. Uh, maybe what equipment you might need to do this process. And we can help you get set up. Thanks.